what is up guys uh Beerus look right here and today i have a psa return which i submitted about a year and a half ago so it finally came back um we went through the middleman service so let's go three of them is uh my friend's one and the other one's mine so first off we have the marni um this is in japan japanese card which is in a gemin 10 so yeah um i'm not really sure um like the rarity and whatnot so this is on my friend's one next off we have oh okay this is the nt i remember when i was um you know submitting this for my friend um i checked it you know i like like there wasn't any scratches on the hollow pattern but if it's like a five or six there's, there's, pro there's a chance it might be like, just like look there's no whitening I don't see any whitening. I don't see any crease. I'm not sure why it got a six. I'm not sure why. I don't. I really don't see any crease. But you know, it is what it is. All right. Next off, we have the Eternatus. I <laughs> I don't know what Pokemon is this. So it's a friend of mine. We just submitted uh Chemin Ten. Modern cards are pretty easy, and of course, this is my card, which is the Illustration Grand Prix Charizard. So this card, okay. So the story about this card is when I was starting out Pokemon, um, I actually met a seller. So I like asked him, you know, like what what's the what's the next card I should buy? You know, what's the card that's gonna gonna stomp? You know, because that was at that time, you know, Pokemon was like um, you know popular, so. Uh, he told me, you know, you should get the, uh, the this Grand Prix, this this promo, you know, it was like a promo, right? So I was like, you know what, I'm gonna I'm just buy. I bought it for like 37 raw and I paid $27 to get it graded. And right now, as, as of right now, I checked the pop report after 1.5 years when I got my copy back. Jamin 10, 11,000. And um, yeah, 11,000 is a lot. You know, for a gem in 10 because the story about this is it was released in Japanese. Then I think you you were supposed to go to like the Pokemon Center and you buy like a booster pack or, or, or whatnot, and then they give you the card. So when you know everyone was doing that and everyone started selling on eBay. So what happened was I think they reprint they reprinted it and then afterwards they reprinted it again for the second time because there was so much copies and I'm not sure whether you all see on on YouTube or Instagram. There are people who who bought like hundreds, you know, copy of this illustration grand uh, illustration grand prix sorry, that, um illustration contest. So the guy you know uh, who illustrated and draw this won the contest, and then they decided to make it public, you know, this cut. But I'm so glad I, I just bought uh one piece, you know, a piece uh, ungraded and just get it uh, raw and then just get it ungraded, um, you know. Because if I were to have bought, you know, or if I, if I were to follow, um, you know, other people who spent, like, who bought 100 copies of Illustrated Grand Prix, um, I don't think that is the best way. Because right now, um, I, I think, you know, on eBay, a Gemin 10, you can probably get it for, like, I want to say, like, 60 USD, you know, so you can just basically... You know, buy it as a gem in ten. So you you don't have to buy raw and grade because there's eleven thousand copy of this. And when I say eleven thousand, it's it's um it's a lot to me. You know, like example, um, this CD promo, there is a lot um in the gem in ten, but I believe I think extra evolution. I'm I'm not sure how, what is the pop report, but I know I know it's for sure it's a lesser. But this right here. Um, has 11,000 that's why um, you know there's, a, there's an argument where like some people say pop report doesn't matter for me um, you know just to see that the year the, the card what, came out like two years ago and it skyrocketed and a pop report is crazy but um, no doubt it's a very beautiful card um, I liked it so uh, yeah I'm, I'm just glad that I didn't like overbuy and like spend you know all my money on on one card you know so yeah i think this is just going to be a collection you know i'm not going to sell it because 
the the price of buying a Gemini 10. So um, that is all, guys. You know, um, you know, I like Charizards. Uh, I also recently picked this up, this Alakazam base set too, and you know the Impel card, of course. So yeah, that's very nice. Um, yeah, so. We'll see, we'll see, you know, we'll see what we are going to submit next or what we're going to buy next. So, yeah. And peace out, Ryan.